going up against in the black gi Gucciari Barboza of Carlson Gracie and Rodriguez representing Costa Rica one of the only if not the only high level black belt on the world scene right now representing Costa Rica yeah no you're definitely right how what do you think are the what do you think is the uh, key to victory here for Sebastian Rodriguez well, number one, he's got to contend with the fact that Gutierrez Barbosa is a very tough, very durable athlete who doesn't make a lot of mistakes and is a very, very solid competitor. Cracking that shell is going to be the initial stage for winning this match. Rodriguez, coming from Unity, it's hard to define his jiu-jitsu in, uh, in simple terms. He has creative guard, he has a good top game, he has excellent attacks. But I would say that he has a, a unique flair to his own game that is a reflection of his, of his own personal body type and personality. But it, he isn't known as a specialist in one particular area. Gutierrez Barboza has some of the best fundamentals so Rodriguez is going to have to maybe get a little creative in, in bypassing those, I feel. Yeah, Gutierrez is a possessor of a really great guard passing game as well. He utilizes the double underhook pass, the double underpass very well. This is sort of an interesting position we find them, them both in. It's not really, it looks like it's a second away from becoming 50-50, but it's just sort of an uh, interesting leg entanglement. Gutierre, possibly moving to the side with a cross face, turning it into a knee cut. Keep that in mind as we watch these high level matches going forward. Special Rodriguez spinning over for maybe a Bernard Bola, but almost gets put back in the Bernard Bola situation himself. If he's not careful, he could potentially get his back taken. Great work from Sebastian Rodriguez. Yeah, slipping that underhook across the body now, entering into what is potentially a passing position as well. But there was definitely a moment where either one of them could have flipped that position and come out on the back. See, you see in the corner of uh, Sebastian Rodriguez, Diego Pato, Devante Johnson, Jefferson Guaresi, all in the corner. Yelling. You know, I think the team name uh, is a really good reflection of the kind of the bond that those guys have because Unity Jiu Jitsu is not one of these multinational associations. It's a relatively small team, mostly based in uh, New York, ripping out that Kimura. Sebastian's trying to get it, and you know, with a few satellite locations. But, uh, but yeah, Unity in, in New York, it's really, they all train together on the same ad, so they bond it very, very strong. Absolutely. Oh, look at this. We see now Rodriguez has passed his left leg over the top. So Gucieri. Oh, he broke the grip away. That position is severely compromised. And if Rodriguez can pull this arm out, he oh, may get the finish here. That's there it. it is. Sebastian Rodriguez finishes it. Finishes it with a beautiful submission. And he punches his way to going against Alex Muniz tomorrow.